Hey Broken Nation, I'm Jordan here with Laura for her first ever video. We are here at Overland Expo Pacific Northwest to show some of you the highlights and a few of our favorite products from the show. Now these are not gonna be all Bronco related, so if you wanna see only Bronco stuff, this is not the video for you. We're just gonna show you some of the highlights, a few of our favorite items, because if you've never been to the show or you wanna get a feel for what Overland Expo looks like, this is going to be the video for you. We've had it requested a few times, so we figured we'd deliver. So let's head on into the expo and check out what these hundreds of vendors have to offer. As the name suggests, Overland Expo has everything you need to get into the overlanding space and take your adventure farther. Whether that's on motorcycle, or you're in a truck, 4x4, SUVs, and more. Now as Laura mentioned, this show has really everything. You, see, you can see on my left there's some rooftop tents on offer, on the right some motorcycles. You're going to see solar setups, you're going to see electrical solutions, shower solutions, all sorts of stuff and anything you need, as Laura said, to take your adventure farther. And we're just going to show you a few of our favorites. Okay, so first up we have this sick old Land Cruiser in the Nomad booth. I don't know much about it to be honest with you guys, but it's a right-hand drive, got a really cool rooftop tent, some great stickers on the back if we can show those. An awning that comes out the back and it's just a really clean, classic build. Lovely color, kind of that desert tan sort of vibe and uh, I would drive it if I could afford it. Get her in her stance, Here's power the thing. stance. <laughs> my, my deciding if I like it. Um, I think it's really cool for what it's worth. It's an Earth Cruiser. Yeah. Or what are your thoughts? Yay or nay? I am, you know, I'm more of a primitive camper, but True. if you are going to do some overlanding, you need an earth cruiser <laughs> like this. And you will be able to go pretty much anywhere. And the insides of these are extremely nice and accommodating. And uh, you're gonna look pretty cool doing it too. Okay, so take a look at this. That's my favorite thing right there. Embraer E175, Delta Connection. <laughs> take a look at this one over here which is actually the version that I would want to be running on the street or off-road. Okay, next are our friends over at Rome. Rome has a bunch of cool new products that we haven't quite shown off, so we're gonna head to their booth here and uh, see what we can find. Okay, starting off strong with the all-new Rome camp chair. Extremely comfortable. It looks very high quality. Laura, what's your sit test review? It is really comfortable, and it looks like it folds up to a good space. We should test it out, actually. Yeah. Let me see. Live on camera, never Oh, that was really easy. That was okay. easy. Look at that. Pretty light. Got like this nice matte black finish on the metal. Some faux, I assume they're faux wood handles. And a canvas material. Cup Extremely holders. comfortable. Great to go in the back of your Bronco, pull up to a uh, meetup or whatever. And look who we have here. It's Jen Hudak herself. <laughs> you Jen, should. why don't you introduce yourself? It's actually very comfortable. <laughs> Laura has been swapped out. We have Jen Hudak, founder of Escapod, five times gold medalist five times X Games medalist, yeah. skier, something like that. Amazing race competitor, and she's pregnant. Jen, what's your pregnant review of the chair? It's actually very nice. It's very comfortable. The normal camp chairs where they like, you can't, you're like. It like cuts off circulation yeah, in your exactly. legs. No, this is and you guys had Yeti chairs. What's, how does it stack like up? That this, uh, the way that it compacts down. Yes. It fits behind the headboard of your Escapod Top 02. Look at that. <laughs> Perfect. Integration, guys. Next cool thing we have here is the Rome landing mat. They just came out with these. It's a really nice uh, double-sided camping pad. You got more of a, I don't even know what I would call this, uh, but a more slick material on the back, a little bit more grippy matte material on the front. Great for camping. If you have an escapod even, this would be great to put outside of it. Priced really well at $99 and makes the perfect addition to any camping setup. This is the Mac frickin' daddy of Earth Roamers. This thing is massive. Okay, we got inside. This thing feels like a freaking yacht. It's super cool, there's music, so excuse it. But look at how nice this is. Got a whole booth back there with surrounding windows, full 270 degree views. Got cabinets up above, this nice like marble-like countertop, induction three burner stove, a wine chiller, and a massive bed up here. This is what I'm gonna go off the grid with. Oh, and a shower with teak floors. Okay, next thing is a really cool new product from Heretic, which is right up here, is the roof rack grab handle. Uh, Built-in lights to it too, for those of you who may not have zone lighting on your Bronco and want a solution uh, to go around the entire vehicle, provide a ton of floodlight when you're setting up camp or on the trails or whatever in the evening. Uh, these are great, they're 319 for a pair, and they're available now on thebronconation.com. Another sick Toyota Land Cruiser. This is one of my favorite colors, like this boxwood green, uh, brown seats. It's just super, super cool. I don't know much about it, like I said, but it's a beautiful truck and I appreciate it for what it is. 
Oh, it smells like an old airplane too. I love it. So I'm a big fan of storage for all my trinkets. I like being organized. So any of the goose gear equipment, whether it's something to create a bed for the back of your Bronco, solidly made, and I would be happy to use this on any overlanding trip. Now we're here at the Snow Peak area. This is one of my favorite uh, camping equipment companies. They're Japanese. Their stuff is top notch. As you can see, very high quality. The fit and finish is of the highest level. Very lightweight, you know, as a lot of the stuff the Japanese do is just built very well and with purpose and intention and efficiency. And Snow Peak is no different. You can even see a couple of their things featured at Bronco Base Camp. But if you weren't at Overland Expo and you're thinking about coming, Laura, what can people expect when they're here at Overland Expo? You can expect a lot of deals and giveaways. Uh, if you're looking for something and you've had your mind on it and you want to see it in person, excellent opportunity to do so. And you might save a few dollars. A lot of vendors here and it's a lot to take in. Almost overwhelming, but you're going to have a great time uh, checking out anything at one of the Overland Expos. It is a great place to shop. There's four uh, Overland Expos around the country, Pacific Northwest, Mountain West, West and East in four beautiful locations uh, across the U.S. And we're going to end our highlights here of Overland Expo Pacific Northwest at our arguably biggest highlight of this entire show, and that is Bronco Base Camp, where you have dozens of Bronco Nation members camped out here in their overlanding rigs, in their ground tents, and even some in some really cool glamping tents we have set up as well. So no matter how they show up, we love seeing them and spending time with this awesome community. Laura, would you say this has been a success? I would say it's a huge success. We got to meet so many more of you guys. We had a great time on the trails in the expo, and I uh, can't wait to do it again at the next one. Yeah, it's so cool to see so many familiar faces and meet new faces for the very first time. So if you came out and joined us for the very first Bronco Base Camp, it was wonderful having you. And if you are coming to a Bronco Base Camp for your second or third time, it's always great having you as well. If you haven't been to a Bronco Base Camp, we would really encourage you to come. You can check out all the information for our upcoming events on the events tab on the thebroncoNation.com, which will be linked in the description. If you have a favorite product you saw in this video, let us know. We know we couldn't show you the entire show as there are over 400 vendors here, but we figured we'd give you a little taste of what you can expect at any of the four incredible Overland Expos across the country. Thanks so much for joining us. As always, you all are the reason we do it. Make sure you subscribe, hit that big red button below, the like button, share the video with a friend, and we hope to see you at a future Overland Expo or any of our Bronco Nation base camps around the country. Thanks so much. Take care, and we will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.